match my computer case how cute oh i can't even show y'all but my phone matches my computer case and my airpod case but i could not find i don't think my ipad's working today i cannot find a case like a matching case for my ipad so i'm gonna show you what i did i just took some stickers i took some stickers this is what i did to my ipad because they didn't have the cases for iPads for some reason. So I had to improvise. It's so cute and it's so cool. But welcome y'all, welcome to my YouTube video. I know it's been a while, okay? Don't get mad at me, y'all know me. Y'all know I'm that one friend that just, you know, be in her own little world and then she come out like, hey y'all. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you are new, welcome to my YouTube channel. This is gonna be so much fun. It's definitely an experience to be here. My nice and my mom. This video is going to be about my experience with European Wax Center. I'm talking about waxing, talking about, you know, using things for your girl. And we're just gonna get like all into that, okay? Because honestly, like, I don't know, I just feel like somebody needs to handle this. Now, me personally, the only thing I wax is my girl, okay? Um, I don't wax my legs or my armpits. We gotta work our way up there, especially with armpits. I'm a little triggered. Yes, I don't wax, I mean, I don't wax like my whole other parts of my body yet, just my girl, because like she really needed it. Pretty good, but she needed it. Everybody else is good, but like she was not having that. Okay, I hear you, something gotta give. So I switched over to waxing. I tried someone and I didn't like it. It was this lady, um, I found her on Groupon, cause you know, I like, you know, I like deals or whatever. <laughs> but I found her on Groupon, and I'm like, okay, she got some good ratings, blah, 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 yada, 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 let me try her. Woo, child, that was, um, mm -mm, never again, I said, you know what? Maybe this ain't for me. It was really um, traumatizing especially since it was my first wax like that hurted like ma'am so that happened and after that i was like you know what <laughs> you don't have a baby shaving baby shaving ain't so bad mm, i don't know i kind of want to try these european wax center pranks out i need to catch my attention i don't know i don't know i just knew that they were like um like professional waxers and i really feel like you know like that's what i needed like i said something you have to give like she was begging for help so switch over to european wax center the first time i went um i went with this girl who i still go to till this day you know i'm not gonna lie well some months were like i big with another girl because it's another girl who i love oh my gosh like, one thing I will say is if you go to your view at center, you better do look at the reviews for real on who you're getting, um, who you're gonna book with because who some nigga girls like and it's not like you know, like it's not like anything personal, but it's like, yeah, I'm going back to her type stuff. Kinda like, you know, when you have like a like a nail tag or a um like a beautician you know you have your own waxer that you like and that you go back to so i alternate between two girls because some days i have to go early some days i might have to go late and it's like if one of them isn't there then the other is so it's like and i know they real good so i go to two girls um they are amazing and honestly like who you have as your you know waxer it's it's gonna make the experience as well for sure because i have some girls i've had i've had one girl where i'm not even gonna tell y'all what city i was in it was not milwaukee though it was you know in a different city but i'm not gonna tell y'all because you know i'm just not that's just not important but yeah i had this one girl and it was like girl i was in there for like 30 minutes like girl <laughs> First time waxing is always going to be the hardest time. And that's really why that one time I got waxed the first time, I was like, hell no. 
and you know it's normal you know what i'm saying but it's like you just gotta rip that band-aid off girl that band-aid with wax that's going to grip your hair and your skin and you're gonna rip it off violently but it's okay because like i said you get used to it um and eventually like it gets easier to do like you won't grow that much hair and all of that good stuff like it gets down to the nitty-gritty which is exactly what she needed because like no like she had no no it's always going to be a tough time and actually if you go to european wax center please tell them that asia kelly sent you and they can look up my name because um yeah yeah so if you go to european wax center from this video then please tell them that asia kelly sent you okay because i'm trying to get my reward points i don't even know if that's what they call it i don't know i'm trying to get my dollars off the first time you go to european wax center you get like 50% off of everything, I think, or something like that. Or a free wax, like a free armpit or something. I don't know. When you buy the wax passes, y'all, buy them wax passes. Especially the first time you buy them. The first time I bought my wax pass and it literally lasted me. Okay, granted, COVID did give it like an extra six months. But it literally lasted me like a year. It did give us extra wax passes like free ones so my wax pants last me like a good 16 to 18 months like without having to pay, just walking in and tipping like you know or you buying a product even because girl them products and we're gonna get into that too because the first time you get a wax pants you can buy like you can buy like six or twelve or nine i think no like six nine five three four five three two one something like that and they give you like a few extra but when you're like when this your first time buying one they give you three extra i think after that it's like two extra or something but that really saves you a lot of money especially since like waxes are like 60 dollars y'all the other day i walked in i'm not even gonna tell y'all how much i spent because i had got a product too but girl i was like you know what next time i'm just gonna hit and buy that wax pass <laughs> because honestly like it just saves you so much money and not only that but like you're paying it in advance so it's like worry about enough for a little bit and then just get it over with definitely beneficial that they have that especially since this is like a recurring service that like you know can get really pricey and that brings me to their products so their products are low-key like really expensive it's not a lot but i will say that they last you just show y'all the things that i have i don't have that many products because i don't even need that many like you you don't need that many you don't need that much you don't need that many products you only need a few i kind of have like a a variety um like a like a diverse group of products <laughs> I have five products and they're all different. I have the Smooth Me Ingrown Hair Wipes. These bad boys, oh, yes, it's so cute. First of all, mine is, okay, yeah, you know, she been through a lot, you know, she's, I've had this for two years and I don't know if it's an expiration date, like for real, for real, but I really hope not because like, I'm not even done. I'm not even nowhere near, y'all. Okay, maybe like, yeah, like I'm halfway done. And it's been, well, not, you know, two years, but it's been almost two years and I've had these. Now, these wipes are as big as this um, circumference. <laughs> and they come big as fuck. And they come in a little stack um, about to like right here. But the key, y'all, and shout out to my waxer because she taught me this she said cut them in half and use them bitch i could probably even cut these in the in, in fours and 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 it still suffice like you don't need a lot down there okay a little bit goes a long way and 
honestly she don't need all of that going on she just need an extra little push an extra you know extra little help you don't need that much and that my friends is why this is still like that like we're playing with her bruh. definitely recommend like if it's something that you if it's one product that you get get that that was my first product that i got okay i'm just going to order here because you know <laughs> gradually we get more so next i have the smooth me ingrown hair serum i gotta put this on after the video because i forgot to put some on today but it's so cute it's a little cute skinny bottle it has a red cap but of course you know i don't know where that is because baby i've had this for like maybe almost two years like maybe like a month or so after the wipes and this one i use more often honestly if we're being real i probably use this once a week like that's just like once a week my first three weeks of getting waxed and then when it's like the week of i don't use it but like once every week will suffice like that's why it's still almost halfway full that is why right there yes this you need especially if you get ingrown hairs y'all i'm telling y'all the ingrown hairs for no reason like i'm just trying to shave literally change your life i have the smooth and refined body polish um it's a hair growth minimizer as well if y'all have not realized all of their stuff are hair growth minim minimizer all of their products are hair growth minimizer okay honey it's gonna slow it down and it's also gonna thin it up okay girl if you have coarse hair then you know if you have coarse hair and you shave and you are considering waxing once you wax you're not gonna go back like the first couple of months you know it might be you know a little rough a little you know give it time okay this is this is new for her this is like kind of very traumatizing like we're laying here and we're just getting the hair ripped out of our skin like that's not very normal just give her some time to adapt give her some time to grow to blossom into the beautiful butterfly that she's gonna become this is what it looks like so cute smells so good i got it because i saw a girl who posted about it on snapchat and she said that i'm not even gonna say what she said but <laughs> it's a body polish and it says that it's um A creamy medium exfoliator and honestly um it's not well i wouldn't say medium i'm gonna show y'all the consistency is very like it has you know a little you know but um it doesn't exfoliate as much like as it could so you see that and then when i like rub it together it kind of feels like I'm like just rubbing thick soap together and it's little small not even grains of sand like it's they're smaller than that like they're so small it really works and it really helps and honestly like I like to do it right when I get in the shower um, because I like to let my um, my water heat up and while it's heating up i'm in the shower i'm in the bathroom too so like my body is getting warmer you know um it's very humid in there and that helps you know kind of soften the hairs um you know on your body so then i take this with my dry hands and i rub it on there okay and i just you know go in whatever motion you go in and then i get in the shower i rinse it off and then i you know wash up so, you know, if you try to get in this, like, if you try to wet your hands and wet your body with this, like, 
soap like drench everything it's it's just gonna sign right off like it's you're not even gonna it's gonna rub on like liquid soap and you won't feel anything you won't get exfoliated and stuff like that so this i use they say use three times a week i use it like once a week maybe twice um but this i use the most so maybe like maybe i do some weeks i don't know it depends like when i was first starting to get waxed i would use it three times a week but now it's probably like two times a week like for real in the beginning you'll probably be going through it a lot faster because this is my second bottle and i um am about to go my third but like i use this slower than i use my first one so the next thing that I have is the Slow It Body Lotion. It's so cute. It looks like this. This I use the least. Um, this, yeah, I use this the least. Um, I typically use it on my legs though when I shave. And I will say that. I have very sensitive skin. And this is my really thin lotion. Like you can hear it. Very thin. And lotion, I don't even use lotion on my body at all. But I will use this um, on my legs because my legs are like really not that sensitive. And it does really well with my legs too. It feels, makes my legs feel really soft. And the last thing that I have is the face and body exfoliating gel. Okay. Super cute. But, um, Honestly, I don't know how this works yet. I used it, or at least I tried to use it. it smells really good though, like super good. I tried to use it um, the day before yesterday. I don't think I did it right. Um, so this is a gel, it looks like this. Um, yeah, it's just a gel, it looks like yogurt or custard or something. And, you know, I was a little confused because it says it's an exfoliating gel. And, well, I tried to exfoliate it and it was like I was just rubbing a gel on her. And I was trying to think because, okay, so this is what my waxer told me. She said, you, she said, before you get in the shower, you take this gel, you rub it on your skin until you start to feel it exfoliate and you're going to start to feel your dead cells, like, I'm off and I'm like oh that sounds really intense like girl yes give me this because that polish like it just it just scratches my shoulder like I need something to burn. like I need something I'm like yeah girl give me that so get home excited to try it this was like a day or two after I got waxed because the first day or two I don't do nothing to her okay she is healing all right so we're gonna give her time to heal so, and you know time to heal I'm like, ooh, I'm about to use this, yada, yada, yada. So I get in the shower, I'm not gonna lie. I forgot she said don't get in the shower, but I didn't fully touch the water yet, just my feet. So I'm like, okay, well maybe, you know, maybe. I'm rubbing and rubbing and rubbing and rubbing. And it's like, um, girl, like, hello, this just feels like soap. And I'm just rubbing, I'm like, okay, well maybe I'm, you know. But then it's like, you know what, am I tripping though? Because you know how like, when somebody tells you something work and then you try to do it and like it don't work but then like you try to convince yourself that it's working and like it's actually not like that's that was i was at that point i was at that point something's not right something is not quite right and i don't even know oh yeah so i'm like you know what maybe i just did that wrong like maybe you got to be completely dry just like you damn not have to be with the polish so i'm like mm, i guess but i'm gonna try it Ooh. I'm gonna try it again in a couple of days and I'm gonna let y'all know in the description how to go. So, yes, those are all of the products that I have. Literally, like, this will be all you need. This will be all you need. And I am not even trying to be funny, but this will really, literally be all that you need. And this is coming from someone who has extremely sensitive skin my skin is so sensitive it's not even funny but that's why i take the time to do what i can to make sure that you know it's all good in the hood i wasn't this art though so i'm gonna go thank y'all so much for tuning into my youtube video of me talking about my experience with the european wax center and also listing off some um 
products that I have and that I will recommend. The whole summary of this video is if you are thinking about waxing, if you have not waxed before, like this is your first time, do it, girl. Go run to it, okay? Because it's going to be a game changer. It's going to be a life changer. And it's really going to make everything a lot more easier. I'm out. Short and sweet, short and sweet. Let's edit this.